I just wanted to say how much of a tool I think Madison Bumgarner is. What is with this guy? Seriously. What is his obsession with Yaziel Puig? Last night, twice, I started, like, basically bench-clearing incidents with Puig. And in my opinion, both of them were on Bumgarner. And the second one was definitely uh, caused by Bumgarner. Got him out, threw him out at first, and then started his whole act of don't look at me. Don't look at me. Don't you dare look at me. All that nonsense to the point where then they had to separate both teams. Puig's like, come on, dude, whatever, let's go. I'm not afraid of you, you ugly white galoof. And then uh, after the game, he was even more of an idiot in the locker room when they were interviewing him. He said, I don't like your line of questioning. This is getting ridiculous. Actually, it wasn't ridiculous at all. It's just that you're such an asshat that we have to ask the questions like, what's your problem, bro, big tough guy, big farmer John, uh, whatever, dude. Like, no one's afraid of you, you idiot. So, uh, please not afraid of him. That guy grew up with nothing. He'll shank your ass. They'll stick your face through one of those uh, lawnmowers out on the farm, son. Uh, your boy down there floating on rafts in the middle of the night for 100 miles to Miami. Believe me, you, he knows a little bit more about survival than you do, tough guy. And then uh, today they all wore shirts, don't look at me. What, do you, what did it say, don't look at me? I mean, how hilarious is that? Everyone's making fun of Madison Bumgarner, and he deserves it. Like, who does he think he is? Royalty or something? Please. Calm down, bro. You don't matter anymore. Even with your fancy, you know, one nothing pitching efforts and in seven innings, no one cares about you. And that crappy team you're on, or that crappy bullpen that blew your game last night, or that crappy bullpen that's about to blow another game tonight, or that crappy bullpen that's within five minutes of blowing this game tonight. Or you sitting over there on the bench with your manager acting like you're some kind of tough badass. Nobody's afraid of you. When everyone's making fun of you, wearing shirts to make fun of you, that's, that's their way of saying we're not afraid of you. We're not afraid of you, tough guy. Big tough guy, huh? You looked like such an idiot last night on television. Uh, picking fights too, by the way. Like who? Like don't look at me. <laughs> I don't want to look at you anyway. You ugly ass. Take a shave, you fat ugly ass. Whatever, bro. No one's afraid of you. <laughs> Please not afraid. Of you. My God, the guy lived on a raft. You think he cares about your Kentucky ass or whatever the hell you lived on? Some farm somewhere. No one cares. Shut up. I now, I now officially don't like him. I don't like. I never liked him before. Now it's official. Can't stand him. Who does he think he is? Like, are you kidding? Don't look at me. That's the funniest thing I think I've ever seen. Don't look at me. Okay, then I'll sleep with your wife. How's that sound? I won't look at you. I'll look at her. I'll spend the night with her. How's that sound?